We've learned while Zubaid Al Jarmi was on probation for committing a cage robbery at one casino, police say he did it again. Al Jarmi, Zubaid. This time, the 25 year old man is accused of a casino cage robbery at Resorts World on November 10th. Sources tell the 8 News Now investigators he arrived in a cab, went inside to commit the robbery, and left in the cab. Sir, you're on probation for a robbery and a burglary. This is a new allegation of burglary and robbery, both with use of a deadly weapon. Aljarmi was on probation for a similar robbery at the Venetian in 2020, and we've obtained the evidence from the case detailing his moves on the Las Vegas Strip. Police say he parks in a garage. While his face is partially covered with a scarf and sunglasses, he walks to the casino, enters, goes to the cage, and slips the worker a note. She hands him the money. He leaves. He's seen here running. His entire path caught on cameras along with his license plate number. Just a few days later, he's taken into custody in Missouri. Police discovered he was in the U.S. on a visa from Jordan, and they found the cash car, scarf, sunglasses, shoes, and that note he slipped to the worker. We know where you live. Don't use police alarm. We are watching you. Now 15,000 cash. Police say Al Jarmi told them he was seeking asylum in the U.S. He had recently lost his job and was struggling to make ends meet as a Lyft driver and poker player. Court records show he received a suspended three-year prison sentence, meaning he was a free man until his arrest at a Las Vegas home this week. In court Thursday, he blows a kiss to loved ones. So I won't be setting bail. You're going to be held without bail. Al Jarmi's next court date is set for November 22nd. Reporting in downtown Las Vegas at the Regional Justice Center, Vanessa Murphy, 8 News Now. The 8 News Now investigators requested an interview with Al Jarmi, but we were told he is unavailable at the moment.